Hey everyone, today I'm going to talk about the red backed shrink uh, which I have just up in my forest here. So I will go out and uh, you will follow me and see the red backed shrink. My name is Jöran Johansson and I'm a nature photographer in the southwest of Sweden. Hey, you couldn't see it coming You might have thought it But you couldn't change it Hey, it's not right or wrong It's about trying Find the sin Hi and welcome to the forest. Today we are going out to look for a bird called uh, Tarnsgata in Swedish. I think the English name is Red Backed Shrike. And uh, I have been here before and uh, I have found one nest in that direction and I have found one nest in that direction. So we will photograph them and uh, film them. It's a special bird. They are uh, in Africa in uh, our winter and in summertime in May they come and in August they leave Sweden again. Here are three cups there and two cups there and there's another place we will go to also and there I'm uh, having three kilometers you can um, take uh, you can run there to get uh, better condition and I will do and I have done that and there I also find one nest and in that direction there are two nesting also so totally I have six nests that I have followed I was out yesterday also in uh, the other one here and if you <laughs> It's a green wooded pecker. Uh, and you can also hear the noise from the red backed shrink if you listen carefully. It's very easy to, to um, walk in the forest and if you hear that noise it's probably that bird. They live in uh, such environment, environment like this and uh, it should be a little bit lower. So this is, I think it's the last year they are here. About one meter up to maximum two meters. 
and the female and the male always sit in the top of a tree and looking for insects. They are diving down and take it and they never miss, never miss. It's uh, like Svartvit flugsnappare in Swedish, I think it's black and white uh, flycatcher in English, I don't know. Uh, they say that they can see things seven times faster than we do. So the insect is actually moving for them in uh, slow motion. And I have studied this bird for three years now and I, have, uh, I haven't seen that I miss any uh, insect at all. So I think that they also see the insects much faster than we do. So um, yesterday I, I get very good pictures and, uh, and movies so I will show you them and I will also take movies today to show you. They are here so uh, we will go out and see. pictures of it. They are feeding one of the cubs. So I will go there. Now I will try on the other nest. It's about uh, 400 meters, 500 meters in that direction. And uh, as you see, I have my bicycle with me. Uh, I have also photographed uh, when I come here, there was um, a deer, two deers, one male and one female. And uh, they were so beautiful and they didn't see me, so I snipe out into the field and take good pictures of them.
have the female just here and two cups I will show you on the picture and I think that the male are in a, in a, an, in a top yes it was the male and uh, they are catching insects now uh, feeding you can hear the feeding <laughs> 